Hi, uh, I'm, I'm Adityeshwar Seth. Uh, I teach at IIT Delhi in the Computer Science Department and I also run a social enterprise called Gramvani. Uh, we've been working since many years on uh, basically how do we build technologies that communities can use directly uh, to uh, empower themselves. So uh, we worked on things like voice-based systems that uh, people use to talk about uh, problems they're facing with government schemes, uh, interesting insights and knowledge that they'd want to share with others. And all of this goes on a public platform. So that puts a lot of uh, visibility to problems that communities are facing. And uh, these platforms are, uh, to a large extent, they're uh, community run in the sense that volunteers from the communities, they decide what kind of content goes on the platform. Uh, they take up issues that people are talking about uh, and they take these up to government officials and other stakeholders to bring redressal. So in some sense, we're really putting technology in the hands of the communities uh, to be able to do uh, things with it um, and while also preserving overall control uh, of managing and governing these kind of technologies. Um, and this, I feel, fits very well with the cooperative principles uh, of uh, just people having more control and ownership and being able to determine their own futures. Um, and this is uh, something that's extremely relevant in the digital economy of today um, because uh, this is uh, just like another phase in capitalism. We're again seeing the emergence of monopolies and uh, individuals and very powerful companies uh, being able to determine uh, the futures and lives of millions and billions of people. And it is very essential that um, the, the control structures get turned around and become more bottom-up um, so that uh, people, workers, uh, users, direct users of these platforms, indirect users of these platforms whose lives are being influenced, all of them have a say in how uh, these technologies should operate uh, and uh, could operate. Um, thanks.